Hello Libra, welcome to your June audio taroscope for 2023. And I'm Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queen's Yorkshire Tarot and Five Tarot. And just before we start, if you'd like to have a tarot card reading with me on a one-to-one -one basis, why not email me at karmaqueens at gmail.com. So back to your reading. And this month you've been brought the Ten of Swords reversed. And it's about just taking one step at a time because it indicates that you may finally have reached a clear and balanced perspective about your life and its immediate circumstances. So take that one step at a time and trust yourself. And you may have recently come through a difficult time and indeed the worst may be over. You've come up with some solutions and plans to improve your situation and that's a good thing. Just be sure you don't make the same mistake which contributed to the problem that you just solved again. And be sure that you see your own role in the manner. In terms of work, it could indicate a serious problem in your workplace. It doesn't have to be the end of the world or the end of your job, but ignoring these problems will not make them go away. You've reached a point where you can now see what's best for you and your thinking is clearer. Take some quiet time to decide what your neck moves next move is. It's really best for you to stay where you are or maybe you need to go. And if you are looking for work, you may be looking in the wrong places. So have a good rethink about that. In love, you may have already taken the steps to improve an existing love relationship. So that's a good thing. However, more work may be needed if this relationship is to survive. Remember, any relationship takes two. Problems are almost never entirely the fault of one party. And if you're looking for love, it's possible that you think that you're more ready for a long-term commitment than you actually are. So give this some deep thought. You don't have to conform to society's expectations unless they're truly right for you. Financially, it can indicate that you have taken some constructive and important steps to improve your financial situation, and that's got to be a good thing, because it's easy to fall back on the old bad habits. So be vigilant and careful at this time, because you are on the right track, so make sure that you stay on it. So that's all from me, Kathleen Robinson. Until the next time, take care.